I'm Gabriella Rundblad. Um, I work at King's College London. I belong to the LDC group. We do research in language discourse and communication. We have a very interesting module, it's quite unique, it's called Medical Discourses. It's taken both at master's level but it can also be taken if you're on a PhD for instance. It's unique because it brings together teachers from a wide range, not just from KCL but actually we have staff coming from UCL as well. So we look at medical discourses both in terms of written texts but uh, predominantly it's also to do with things like parent, uh, uh, doctor-patient discourse, it's got to do with discursive psychology, we have people looking at um, ethnography and interviewing. It ranges from things like Foucault and the theory and it's about truth and meaning to very practical examples where the students are asked to analyse interviews or they're looking at newspaper clips about some kind of medical advancement. Um, we're looking at scare stories for instance uh, and so on. It's, it gives you the basics in medical discourses regardless of whatever that might mean. If it's spoken, if it's written, if it's professional, if it's lay, if it's patients, if it's doctors and so on. So it gives a very good starting point to uh, discourse analysis.